Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time joining me, welcome. Please follow the housekeeping rules, which is to click on the subscribe button, give this video a big thumbs up, and leave comments in the section below. If you're one of my returning esteemed subscribers, Akwaba, Caribou, welcome back. Today, I'm going to be letting you listen to a breaking news story, and I'll come back afterwards. Miss Mercedes Moore was found at the Cortland Apartments on Point West Circle yesterday. KPRC 2's Devin Clark is live for us now in Richmond with the latest information on this investigation. Devin? Lauren, there's a lot of confusion being expressed by neighbors of the Instagram model who tell me that the Cortland Apartments is usually very quiet, but news of what investigators are calling a murder-suicide has them on edge and on a quest for answers. Oh my God, that's, that's scary. News of what Richmond police are calling a murder-suicide is rocking the Cortland apartment complex. Because it's safe over here. We have the gates, the fence, everything, you know, you got to have a code to get in, code to get out, and, you know, I'm just in shock. Yesterday afternoon, investigators say they discovered the body of Janae Gagné, better known on social media as Miss Mercedes Moore, along with the body of a man in his 30s, believed to have killed her and then himself. What I thought was safe, it seems it's not. And we have so many rules and so many guidelines. I would never expect someone to breach our security and someone being murdered on this property. The death of Moore, who had over two and a half million followers on Instagram, grabbing the attention of celebrities like music artist Tori Lanes, who posted this picture of her with the caption, rest in peace, queen. Neighbors echoing the sentiment and also hoping for answers. And one of the answers they're looking for is why there is no motive yet released in this case. We're also waiting on the autopsy results to determine the cause and manner of the death. So there you heard it. Uh, tragedy strikes in Richmond, the suburb of Houston. Um, young lady, um, Instagram influencer. Um, met her untimely death um, in a leafy suburb of Houston um, in a gated and supposedly secure estate um, as the neighbors described it they've got fences they've got walls and gates and security codes um, but this young lady um, Mercedes Moore um, um, I'm not sure why the news station reported her as an Instagram model um, because I think she's an Instagram influencer um, or shall we call her a slay queen and I mean no disrespect Instagram influencer, slay queen, they're all the same um, young ladies, you know, really trying to make ends meet um, what do we know about her? Mercedes Moore, like we said, Instagram influencer, um, 2.6 million followers, um, living the apparent high life, um, enjoying life, living life to its fullest, um, apparently cut down, um, literally cut down, uh, because she was apparently stabbed. Um, no motive so far, but I'm sure we will all begin to speculate as to what happened. Um, she wasn't killed in her own apartment. Um, she was obviously you know, killed in an apartment um, that um, she visited. Um, the assailant, apparently, after killing her, um, killed himself, so it's being called a murder-suicide, which is the usual thing when people kill people. Um, now, could it have been a jilted lover? Could it have been a jilted suitor? Um, we don't know at the moment, um, but sad to say, this young lady has had her life cut short. Um, no matter what she did, no matter who she offended, if she offended anybody, nobody deserves to go through this. Um, but then again, um, I think um, a lot of young ladies need to be cautious of who they um, engage with, um, both on social media and in social circles. Um, 2.6 million fans, um, there are lots of psychos out there, lots of psychotic people out there who might be coming for you, um, professing love and um, 
you know I mean even ordinary girls on the streets get more proposals than they know what to do with let alone somebody who is famous and um, she moved in sort of high circles um, the entertainment industry so it's very sad um, my condolences to her family um, I'm sure they're going through a lot of uh, tough times at the moment, um, but I'm sure God will give them the strength to bear the loss. So, um, yes, that's the uh, breaking news. Um, African-American Instagram influencer killed in apparent murder-suicide. Tragic tragedy. But what does this teach us? What does this tell us about what we do and how we do it? more to come in the days to come peace one love that is me for today if you have any questions comments please leave them in the section below if not i will see you on the next video again peace one love